Let's take a look at a couple hounds. I have my really beat up vintage one as well as the, uh, the new movie themed um, reissue of him. I was planning to wait to do a review on G1 Hound uh, until I had a few more accessories from him. For example, his uh, iconic shoulder cannon I have coming in the mail, but it's not here yet. But I got this guy in the mail today from uh, Hasbro Pulse and I really want to get my hands on it, so ah, uh, the hell with it, I'm opening it. I've been wanting to get a few of these movie reissues, uh, but Hound is the first one I picked up. So new Hound comes packaged in vehicle mode. Um, you also get a few extra accessories, firing missiles. This is the, uh, the shoulder cannon and his gun. That's really out of focus, sorry. He's a much brighter, brighter green. I've attached, yeah, the gasoline can, the tire and the, the rotating gun here and it, it does pivot. I love the minty green winch. His tires are rubber and there is a good bit of die cast on him. Seeing him next to the vintage one just kind of highlights how much is missing from this guy. I gotta get to work on completing him. I'll always love my original Hound, but I was really excited about picking this guy up because this brighter color scheme I think really looks, is gonna look a lot better with the, the other Autobot cars I have. There are those trademark teeny tiny arms. Armets. Right alongside his vintage counterpart. Hound really is a must have for Transformers fans, uh, but if you are interested in reissues, I do think the new guy is very much worth picking up. I mean, it's a crisp new Hound with all the accessories for a decent price.